right, welcome back. We got the Creighton 8S out with the Coke can motor and we are gonna do some testing before I head out anywhere far. I wanna make sure everything with uh, the DX5 rugged is, uh, is correct. Brakes are, brakes are pretty hard. You can see the brakes are set up really, really hard. And the steering's pretty limited. So I'm gonna take some brake down. That seems pretty good. Now my steering's limited, so let's go to some steering. Steering is really limited on this uh, servo. cars out here right now. barely make a turn without hitting the curb. That's full crank. Full crank. Look at the turn. Can't even make a turn on a two-lane highway. I have to hit the brakes to get it to turn. And this way is even worse. So I gotta figure out how to get this thing to turn more on this remote. I want endpoints. Huh. That's 120, right? God, come on. Left. I don't even see it moving. I'm at 140 right and left and I didn't see any difference
another car. Another two cars. I'm just out here testing. I can't run here with all these people uh, coming in and out lately. I need to get a steering servo in this thing. And I think I need to kick the punch up. It definitely needs more gear. Brakes are working great. But I need a lot more gear. Because this motor does an RPM, it's a torque monster. to get the punch turned up too. So 100% need a steering servo and I need a taller gear. go guys there's the test I am running the two new 70c batteries I will be trying my other batteries I don't even see the fan on check motor temps see if I can even touch this motor motors ice cold it's not even working so I'm gonna go ahead and stick a taller gear in this for sure and uh, that way we can get some more speed out of it. But thanks for watching the first test. We still got some work to do. See you guys on my next video.